that supplemental levy because weather is not going to impede you from getting out anywhere or even just having fun even if you're not going to vote, right? Bro? Absolutely. It just keeps getting better and better, Spencer. That gradual warming trend continuing. We made it up to the upper 50s yesterday. Did you love it? I did. Yeah, I'm, lo I'm, I'm looking forward to later this week where it'll there you go. E be even higher than that. Right. OK, so we even hit 60 degrees in Ontario yesterday, 58 in Mountain Home and those mid 50s in Twin Falls as well. 56 there in Twin Falls for a high yesterday. Now to put that in perspective for you, we should be in the low 50s to be on average with normal for this time of year. So 53 is that mark that we're shooting for. Definitely above that yesterday and about 10 degrees above that today. Now take a look at that record set in 1970 degrees degrees we will actually be at or surpassing that mark by the middle of this week so near record temperatures really warming things up by Thursday and even into Friday 37 currently in Boise 38 in Twin Falls in the Magic Valley now even though we're seeing mostly clear skies in southwestern Idaho right now we're going to see a band of clouds moving in through about midday today and then those clouds will decrease for a mostly sunny afternoon so really not all that bad as we head through the day a slight breeze out of the southeast but that'll only help to warm our temperatures temperatures just a little bit breaking up that cloud cover as it moves in from the west and high pressure ridge continues to strengthen and move towards the north and as it does we're going to see that high pressure high pressure generally spins in that uh, clockwise rotation and it's driving the warmer and milder temperatures up from the south I flew in from Vegas yesterday and it was definitely in the 70s and very very sunny there they're hitting the mid 80s by the middle of this week and that's what we're going to see here is the 70s here just a little bit to the north of Vegas and as we move through today, again, variable cloudiness with uh, clearing in the afternoon. Now let's take a look at our highs for the Treasure Valley today. Low 60s, even better than yesterday, with partly cloudy again, clearing out in the afternoon and evening for mostly sunny skies. And in the Magic Valley, not looking too bad either. Upper 50s for Shoshone and Burley, and low 60s for Gooding and Twin Falls. So looking really good for this week, with warming coming Thursday, 71 degrees. Just beautiful tomorrow and the next day. 67 cooling off a bit for Friday and then a slight chance of some scattered showers sneaks in for the weekend. Now, I do mention showers because today there's a slight chance that the central mountains of Idaho, west central and east central mountains could see some scattered showers, but with temperatures even above that mid 40s mark, really no chance of snow of snow today, but uh, maybe a chance of rainbows on yeah. St. Patty's Day. And I hear it is warm enough. I believe 61 degrees is actually the threshold that leprechauns can survive oh, coming really? out of hibernation. Okay. So they should be out and about this week. Did you read that on the internet? I did. Well, then it's true. It's facts. Right, absolutely. Obviously. Okay. So we're looking forward to Sunday. Right,